In my update last week, I mentioned a review of the HSE corporate centre structure. COVID-19 has changed the way we work in lots of ways. My aim is that the new structured HSE centre will build on momentum we've already achieved during this period. We want to keep the improved decision making and speed of response between the HSE centre and our services. We're now moving to phase two of the review, building detail into the design of the new structure. I will keep you updated on how we're progressing, aiming to put in place changes towards the end of the first quarter in 2021. Today is the last day to complete HR's online survey to find out what percentage of our staff have a disability. I encourage you to complete the survey. It's important that we have accurate information so that we can support all of our staff to do their job. The survey is anonymous and there's only a couple of short questions. You can access this survey through the staff news page. Finally, we're now in our second week of level five restrictions. I want to acknowledge that for some, this is more difficult a second time around. Particularly for those of you who've worked so hard delivering frontline services since March. I've said before that in lots of ways, we have a tougher task dealing with this in the second phase. We're responding to COVID-19 while delivering all of our other health services, but it's encouraging that the public are responding again to our call to arms and their efforts are having an impact. The key COVID-19 trends hopefully start to improve in the right direction. Please mind yourselves, during this time, we have a challenging winter period ahead. We need to take care of our physical and mental health and also watch out for our friends, family and colleagues. Thank you.